Hey guys, welcome to What I Ate Wednesday. Similar to last week, I have granola with strawberries. Um, and then this granola actually has like dehydrated uh, raspberries in it. When I got it, I thought it would be a really cool idea. But now, having the sweetness from the real strawberries, like the fresh fruit, and then the tartness of the dried raspberries, it doesn't really work too well. Um, so I don't prefer it, but I've opened it, so I'm going to finish it. But yeah, definitely on like fresh fruit, or even you could do frozen, but is the way to go. I thought that mixing with the dehydrated would be good, but no. Anyways, so that's going to be my breakfast. No coffee this morning. Um, we're just going to have fruit because a couple, was it last week? I think so, yeah. And I mixed this plus my coffee and it just also wasn't a good mix. So just this for breakfast and um, maybe I'll have a little tea later or something. We just dropped Molly off at the vet after meeting with the oncologist and now we got ourselves Starbucks. The cost of all of Molly's treatment for chemo is a lot more than I thought so. Um, I don't know, we're just having something to calm ourselves down and treat. And I have so much um, money on my Starbucks card that I get as, well, from year-end presents as from my students. So I'm not actually paying for it. Otherwise, we wouldn't spend like $5 on a drink. Anyway, so look at all this writing. I have a vanilla bean frappuccino with a pump of peppermint um, and with skim milk. So that's what, and then Dan's eating or drinking a... Caramel macchiato. Caramel macchiato. Mm. It's good. You'd have to definitely like peppermint because it's, well, it is still sweet. It's bordering the very peppermint, like not enough sweetness, but I love peppermint, so it's worth it. We're home again and Molly's back home. Um, so now we're having some lunch. So we have a nice salad and then we are making um, these Gardein crispy chicken mandarin orange because well, again, this week they are on for $2.99, so we're stocking up. We wanted to find a veggie ground beef, but um, they didn't have that one. It's looking awfully saucy. <laughs> saucy! And then later today I'm going to work, and then we have a concert um, for all of mine and the other teachers are international students. Um, so they didn't, so well, some of them competed at the kind of big Victoria Festival, but the other ones that they just weren't as confident, didn't want to, but we still wanted to have them work towards something and perform. So we have the concert tonight, um, and we're just making it a fun thing. Um, so the teachers were bringing food and other kind of snacks and drinks, stuff for after. So I'll show what I'm bringing, because um, I'll probably be having some of this. I have these snacks that I think they're... So to my best knowledge, best of my knowledge, I think they're rice cracker snacks. <laughs> and then I have some brownies. I decided, I, with everything going on with Molly and just, I don't know, I didn't bake anything. So I just have these ones that I'll cut up. Um, the concert's only at 7 o'clock in the evening, but I'm not coming home after work. So that's why I'm bringing it like this. And then I have a big plate that I'll take it with. And then I also got some of these little wafer cookie sticks. And then I have some apple juice as well as um, honey lemon ice cream tea. And then one of the other teachers is bringing pop or like soda and then also a whole bunch of fruit, fresh fruits. That'll be good too. Um, so yes, yeah, so hopefully I'll have some brown. <laughs> That's what I'm looking for. <laughs> I put some Dijon yogurt dressing on mine. And then, oh, these are so good. They're really sticky, but they're delicious. Mmm, really good. So, that's what we're gonna have for lunch. I'm off to work and I have a very full tea that I'm taking and it's my new favorite tea. Oh, I think I just spilled. Um, it is Bigelow Vanilla Chai Tea. It's so good. I've, for I don't know, like two years I had, I loved chai tea and I used, I think, a stash brand, but then I just got sick of it. But now I'm having this one and the vanilla makes it so much better. It just makes it a little bit sweet. Plus I also put in my unsweetened almond milk. Just, yeah, it's just so excellent. So, although I don't know if I'm gonna have enough room to put almond milk in there, but maybe just a little bit. Um, so yes, that's what I'm taking to work with me. And I've been actually loving this now more than the peppermint. Oh, whoa. <laughs> It fell apart. 
now we get to eat our shepherd's pie. But as Dan was dishing it, I was like, what about all the veggies? And he's like, I forgot the veggies. Because we didn't have any like vegetarian gravy packets or like any gravy packets, so he made it from scratch. And then he said he was just so concerned about timing and stuff of the gravy, like getting it done, to so be ready when I got home, he forgot all the veggies. So, but that's okay, it still looks good and smells good. We have the homemade gravy made with water, flour, cornstarch, soy sauce, and garlic, and then starting to boil some water, then the potatoes, and then also cauliflower to make those mashed potatoes a little bit healthier. So they were put in the boiling water. Then we fried up some onions, along with green onions, vegetarian ground beef, and TVP, texturized vegetable protein. And then we put that ground beef mixture in the bottom of a round casserole dish and then poured the gravy on top of it and then mixed it all up a bit. Then we mashed together the potatoes as well as the cauliflower, both of them have been cooked now. And then spread it on top of the mixture in the casserole dish. And then we put it all in the oven at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for 20 minutes, and it comes out all bubbling and delicious. Mmm, that is actually really good. Better than if we have real gravy. And I like that it's healthier because it's not just mashed potatoes, it's half mashed potatoes, half mashed cauliflower. Mmm, mmm, that's really good, honey. Yeah. Mmm, delicious. Eating one of my chocolate straws <laughs> that I brought. And then that's going to be it for today. So thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys next week. <laughs> Bye.